EA Sports coverage of the National Football League is on the air. Today we hit double digits week 10 and we've got a good one in store as it'll be the Washington Commanders taking on the Seattle Seahawks. Shadows starting to get a bit longer. Week 10 of the NFL season is here, and we're underway on EA Sports. And this will go as a touchback, and they will begin things at the 25. Here's Walker to start the drive. And they'll get it up just short of the 45 at the 44. First play of the drive, a success, 19 yards. Well, there you go. This offense off to a strong start this afternoon. Yeah, with a big run and a first down. That's putting what you practice into play. That's excellent execution to get things started. Took just one play to move all the way to the 44 as they try again on first down. Hey, let's go Sunday, Sunday. Let's go Sunday. Back to Walker on first down. And he carries this one past the midfield stripe and into commander territory. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves him with a second and three. The Seahawks at 0-8 now of the year. And they come in mired in a brutal stretch right now. Losers of eight straight games. Could you imagine being in those coaches' rooms right now? And you remember the old expression, there's no such thing as a bad idea? That's really true right here. They're searching for any idea, anything that can galvanize this team and find a victory and get them out of this losing spin. There he goes left side. And he'll cross over out of bounds right at the 25. That one covers 24 yards. It's a first down. And let's face it, that what we just saw there, not a surprise, is it? I mean, this is what he does well. And if you don't tackle him as soon as he catches the ball, <laughs> this is the end result. Big yardage afterwards. Got the speed, the agility, so good with run after catch him. Only in the first quarter, so they better get a wrangle and a hold on that quickly. Yeah, you're exactly right. What's really difficult to try and defend him is if you want to press him so that you get him on the ground quickly after the catch, a lot of times he'll just run past you at the initial point of contact, and he'll go deep. On second down, it's Walker. And tackled down after a gain of three. Leaves him with one yard to go on third down. And that's some good tackling there to keep him short of that yellow line. Yeah, and defensively, all I'm thinking is that on that play, get me to third down. Get me into a position where I can make one more play and get my defense off the field. Here now, third and a yard. They'll try for the first with Walker. And he takes it down to the 13 and picks up the first. A third down gain of three yards, and that'll be enough. If you make the stop there, maybe you hold him to three on this opening drive. They didn't get the stop. Yeah, new set of downs now. Now you're worried about, just as you pointed out, not just giving up three, possibly giving up six. Let's see what they decide to do here because they've got to change up what they have been doing. It hasn't been working. Now Gino on first down. Throw out wide to Walker. And inside the five here, the thing is out of bounds right at the three. It's a 10-yard gain there to set him up first and goal. A lot of precision being shown on this opening drive. They've been methodical, they've been crisp, and as a reward, they're going to be set up with an early first and goal. Walker. We'll take this into the end zone for a Seahawk touchdown. And that caps off what was really a balanced opening drive for them, Charles. They work in the rushing game and the aerial attack, and they end it with a touchdown. Strong in so many ways, wasn't it, partner? Their ability to throw it and run it and accomplish their goal, they've got to like the way that they started this ball game.
Extra point up and through by Myers. And that makes the score 7-0. Touchdown, here's Myers to boot it away. And it'll come out to the 25. Austin not going to try and return it. First and 10 here for Hal and the Commanders at their 25-yard line. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And this will be a gain of five as he gets it to the 30. Ball on the 30. They'll come up with a second and five. A gain of five brings up second and five at the 30-yard line. Shotgun handoff to Gibson, and he'll be brought down shy of the 40 at the 38-yard line. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Back to throw, Howell. And so far as the defense is certainly coordinated. Both levels doing their jobs in tandem. The back helping the front, the front helping the back. The pressure got home on that last play and forced him to try and throw through contact and short of the sticks. Second and ten. Up the middle they go with McAllister. He'll get about three as he's brought down right around the 42. So seven yards from the first down here as they come up to the line of scrimmage. Making the handoff, Howell. He'll drop it off to McAllister, his running back. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. It's a nine-yard gain, and it keeps the drive moving. Plenty of things to talk about here, partner, but to me, their defense gave up a touchdown on the first drive. How about how they're responding, coming back? That's a big third-down pickup to keep their drive alive. Now some movement before the snap. And we'll hear from our referee for the first time this afternoon. The full start backs him up five, first and 15. throw it looking for McLaurin and he's got him and he'll go down but not before getting this inside the 30 so from Seahawk territory now it's first and 10 as they're down to the 29 yard line they'll run up the middle with McAllister and he can only manage to get a couple Second and eight coming up. Second 
Second down. Hal now. He's going to flip that out to the flat. It's complete. Yeah, that's good for a gain of six. And now that sets up third and two. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. something else. On play action, they'll throw. Dotson has it. Touchdown. 